Also, I don't do those little intros anymore where I like film videos on my face because they're just, just so awkward to watch for me personally because I'm like, who does she think she is? So I don't do those anymore. But if you want to see my pictures of this look, then make sure you go follow my Instagram, Makeup by Sabix O, you know, that's where the party's at. I need to come up with a username that's kind of childish, but whatever, it's fine. Um, yeah, I gotta go finish writing my college essay now. So I will see you guys in my next video. Peace out. Peace, love, positivity. Look at my chip nails. Hello everybody, so I haven't filmed a video in such a long time and I just wanted, there's lipstick on my tooth. I just wanted to apologize for me being a failure, but I'll explain later in the video why I haven't filmed. I really hope you guys enjoy this look. I want to start filming more over the summer. I want to do more vlogs, like other kind of videos, not just makeup videos, because that's what my passion is. Like I just love binge watching YouTube videos and I want to be somebody that people want to binge watch. That sounds really weird. If you want to see more videos from me, then make sure you subscribe so I know that people actually care. And if you have any videos you want me to do, make sure you comment down below. And yeah, let's just go ahead and get into this look. It's kind of a summery, like glowy, like whoop whoop. It's kind of different because I usually never do like pops of color on the lower lash line like this, but there's a first for everything. So yeah, let's just go ahead and get into the video. This shirt is broken and there's a, definitely a stain on it, but I honestly, like, should I just change? It's gonna bother me the whole video. Let me just change real quick. I think I'm gonna use my Jaclyn Hill palette for this look. I really wanna do like a nice brown on the eyes and then like maybe a pop of color on the waterline since I haven't done anything like that on this channel yet. Um, yeah, so we're just gonna go ahead and go in first with like this color for a nice like, you know. So I haven't filmed a video in so long. Um, I don't really know how to begin my apologizing for being a failure of a YouTuber, but Junior year is literally the worst thing that's ever happened to me, personally. Um, there's just like, like, I, like, there's just like so much that happens and so much that goes on. And then that on top of being like, I dance at a studio like literally five days a week, six days a week, something like that. And it's just a lot, it's a lot to handle. It's a lot to put on one plate. And especially junior year, which is like one of the most important years of high school. It was just a lot. Yeah. One thing I do know is that I missed filming so much. I find something so like calming and relaxing when I like film and edit videos for some reason. Like I don't know, I just missed it. But there was literally no time. I like if I wasn't doing homework, if I wasn't at dance, if I wasn't like friggin' crying, then I was sleeping or talking to my friends or trying not to lose my mind. So yeah, there was not really any time for YouTube and I just wanted to apologize because I've missed it and I don't know if any of you guys miss me doing videos. The three people that watch me, it's it's something I've always wanted to do. Like ever since I was freaking 11 watching Bethany Moda, like I was like, I want to do this. And now that it's summertime and I have two weeks of school left, two or three weeks. And after that, we're smooth sailing, smooth sailing. I want to have so much fun this summer because I can drive now. I have a job so I can make money and actually do stuff. So I'm really, really excited for that so let's hope that all goes well and I want to vlog too so if you guys want to see vlogs like let me know because I kind of want to vlog but like I don't know I feel like I'm not interesting sometimes but then sometimes I feel like I'm like funny so maybe you could laugh at how boring I am I don't know but yeah all right so next I'm gonna go on with like this darker brown color yeah yeah we're going in I'm putting that on that outer kind of corner so yeah basically where I've been is school um yeah, AP World is literally the worst class I ever took in my whole entire life. Like, do yourself a favor and don't take AP World. Like, I love learning about history and everything, but something about that class is, I don't know. Like, I've never been a person who, like, gots, like, who gots, who gets, like, C's and D's on tests, but I literally, every single test we've taken in the world, I've gotten a C or D on. And it's just so, it's so degrading because I will try and, like, spend so much time studying. I'll know the content, be confident about it, and then when I get my test back, it's a 7 out of freaking 21 and I'm like oh like what did I even like why did I even try so yeah I don't know if it's just like the teachers I had or I don't know I guess I could have tried harder I really don't understand it but yeah AP world is just terrible and I'm really hard on myself when it comes to schoolwork and like tests and grades and stuff so like when I don't do well it's just it's bad it's just really bad 
And I also took AP Lang, which is literally like so like chill. Like AP Lang is so chill. Like I'm somebody who likes writing essays and stuff. So like for me, that class isn't that bad. But like if you don't read and if you don't like writing, like you probably won't like it. All right, next I'm gonna go in with this like gold color right here. And just put that on the inner corner and yeah, you, you already know. You already know, you already know. I'm gonna use my finger because I feel like honestly, some eyeshadows is best to use your finger with them, so yeah. I'm gonna go in with this um, creamy, like sparkly pearl shade and just in a corner highlight. You know, already know. Like, I'm gonna take the same brush I always use. It's a brush I found at a dance competition. <laughs> so, yeah. Alright, there's already gold in my inner corner. That's kind of annoying, but it's, it's fine. So, I'm gonna get my liner and lashes off camera. I'm gonna be using my Kiss number 11 lashes and then my e.l.f. liquid eyeliner to do a little wing and all that. So, I'll be right back. Alright, so next I'm going to highlight my brow bone with the Fenty Beauty Starstruck Matchstick. And Alex, if you're watching this, I love you. She got this for me. So, kisses. Wow, that's so pretty. I don't even know if the camera's picking it up. It's literally so beautiful. So, I'm going to take a break from the eyes. I want to do one more thing, but first I'm going to do my face makeup. So, I'm going to take my baby skin and my professional mix them together and apply them all over my face. I'm annoying myself because I really told myself I had so much stuff to talk about like in this video and I can't think of anything but I I don't know like when I already my makeup I just kind of get in the zone and I like, kind of like focus like for me make it's more of like an art expression thing like I dance but like also I find makeup like doing makeup relaxing like I don't know and, like even doing other people's makeup like I just it's like painting like it's like art like so now I'm gonna take my Tarte Shape Tape Foundation and this is the shade medium honey and I know I'm gonna get roasted because this is definitely too dark for me but you know it's fine I wore the most skin revealing shirt that I have so you can see how much it does not match me so enjoy the show please I just have to start looking at colleges soon and life is just moving so fast and sometimes I'm like wow like we're really out here growing up like I just remember being 11 and like oh my god I can't wait to be 17 I'm gonna have so much fun and now I'm like wow I'm 17 like please help me like send it. every youtuber who raves about this brush the M49 M439 brush is actually so correct it's literally my favorite brush ever it just it just buffs foundation in the skin so nicely and I just I'm a fan I'm a fan so I feel like this brush is kind of too big so then I'll go in with my Morphe sponge and just kind of like blend it out up here because I just get kind of scared my shirt fell off and I had to fix it, so that was um, slightly traumatic, no big deal. Yeah. Also, my dad brought beets home and I literally haven't eaten in, like, I had two bowls of cereal earlier this morning and that was it. So, you know, healthy diets, healthy eating habits, guys. I'm not taking, since I'm not taking any flash pictures, I'm going to go ahead and you go, okay. I'm going to go ahead and use my Cody Airspawn. Now, this... I took the sifter out of it and totally forgot and let it splash on my backpack for a good two months. So this is definitely filled to the brim with powder. So we're just going to watch me get asbestos in my lungs when I open it up. Jesus Christ. Do we see that? I really love like the feeling of baking, but like I don't actually like like baking. Like, I don't know. That made no sense. I'm just going to stop talking. I look like a robot. But it's fine. I'm just gonna go ahead and contour with my handy dandy wet and wild thing. Um, I dropped her at a dance concert and literally it's just she's falling apart, but it's really fine. It's my favorite shade of all time. We're just gonna use her till she's all gone. It's literally only three dollars. I don't know why I haven't bought a new one yet, but I'm just lazy, so I don't really like bronzing under here because I feel like it doesn't do anything. Maybe I just do it wrong. I don't know. I don't know. Remember earlier in the look I said that I was going to go back in and finish the eyes up. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this sparkly teal turquoise color and I'm going to put on my lower lash line just to give this that like summer pop of color. So yeah, let's just please pray that I don't ruin this whole look by doing this because in my mind it looks cute but will it actually look cute on me? Who knows? Probably looked so awkward on camera. No, I think I like it. It's just weird because I never really put anything on my lower lash line ever, so like this is kind of weird. I don't know. I'll probably hate it later, but it's whatever. 
I'm going with some bottom lash mascara and I'm just going to use the Great Lash by Maybelline. This is like my favorite mascara of all time and it's literally, I say literally so much, I'm terrible. It and then I put some on my top lashes just to blend the lashes together with my real lashes. Alright, so now we're back, dusted everything off, and we're going to just finish it up with some highlighter. I'm using the Becca Opal highlighter, the little sample mini size, because it's adorable, and it's my favorite highlighter recently, and I think it's going to be my staple summer highlight, just because it's so, like, gold, and you know. Just, we love a, we love a gold highlight. And I'm also looking in the mirror behind the camera again, because I don't feel like getting out my mirror, so. Wow. Dot on my nose. Keep it well. Alright, so for my lips, I put on a little, like, random lipstick that I have, but I think I'm going to go with this Lorac Pro lip gloss. It's like a fun pink color called Summer Cummer. Cup. Summer color. Alright, y'all, so this is the finished look. I hope that you guys enjoyed watching me do this. If you did, make sure you give this video a thumbs up and comment below. Koalas are cool, so I know that you stay to watch till the end, and I know that you're a real one, unlike these fakes out here who just show up for the first two minutes and like, oh, you're great job. Like, no. The real ones, no. The koalas are cool. But, yeah, make sure you guys go follow my makeup Instagram where I post pictures. I'll post more pictures of this look, you know, updates about my life, why I'm a failure, why junior year is terrible, you know, more stuff like that that you really care about hearing. I know you do, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this video, and I will hopefully see you in the next one. Peace out.